Okay. Good day, everyone. So welcome to the new lesson in mathematics. I am Ma'am Angela Capus, your teacher for today. So for today's video, we're going to discuss how to integrate problem using trigonometric substitution. So are you ready? I hope so. So before we start, let me first share my screen. Ayan. In this um, video, I'm going to use Jamboard to um, explain what I explain. Okay. So try this. Integrate 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared. Or in other words, integrate the integral of 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx. So, paano natin gagawin yun? So, to get the um, definite, a definite integral ng ating problem or ng ating given, we can now use the trigonometric substitution. So, ayan. So here, integral of 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx. Ang una natin gagawin is to find the value of our x and dx. So let our x. Ay mahanap natin sa ating sine function. So replace x sa ating sine of u. And then, we can also replace dx sa ating derivative ng sine. So, what is the derivative ng ating sine? It is the cosine. So, cosine of u then du. Now that we have the uh, value of our x and dx, we can now proceed to our solution. So, ayan. Copy lang muna natin. So, integral of 1 over square root of 1 minus, then substitute the value of our x. So, x is equal to sine u. And then, multiply natin siya sa our dx. So, our dx is cosine u du. Pero, hindi pa dyan, hindi pa ito ang ating final answer. So, kung mapapansin nyo, Pwede pa nating i-simplify yung ating 1 over sine of u dito. So, paano? We can um, find the value or replace value ng ating 1 minus sine of u sa ating Pythagorean identities na alala nyo pa ba yun? So, kung naalala natin, ang ating sine squared of u plus cosine squared of u is equal to 1. And then, using this identity, paano natin derive sa 1 minus sine of u? So, pwede natin siyang i-substitute sa ating sine. Diba? Sa uh, we bought a uh, subtract sine sa dalawang side. So, Ayan, ang ating sine dito, sine squared of u, imamayas natin sa sine, uh, sine squared of u para makancel out siya dito sa side na to. Plus, cosine of u squared, ay, of u. And then, copy the 1, then minus sa atin ang sine squared u. 
now we can cancel out ang ating sign dito kasi sine squared um u minus sine squared u is equal to 0. So, hindi na natin siya isusulat. Then, bring down cosine squared u and then equal to 1 minus sine squared and u. Now, meron na tayong 1 minus sine squared u na dito. So, we can now replace this one. So, ayan. Proceed tayo sa continuation ng ating solution. So, integral of 1 square root of what is the replace value ng ating 1 minus sine um, of u. So, ang ating value ay cosine squared u. So, copy natin yan. Cos squared u. And then, copy this din natin yung side na to. Cos u du. Now, meron na tayong integral of 1 over square root of cosine squared u multiplied by cos cosine u du. Hindi pa dyan natatapos kasi we can now simplify etong nasa baba. Kasi meron pa tayong radical sign. So, the square root of cosine squared i cosine. And then, copy the u. Then, multiply. Copy natin cosine u du. So, now, Pag minultiply natin ang 1 over cosine u sa ating cosine u du, ang magiging sagot ay, makakancel natin ito eh, ay square um, integral of copy the 1 and then du. So, integral of 1 and then du I equal sa ating u plus the constant c. So, paano naman natin makukuha yung ating u? So, aw, kung mapapansin nyo dito sa ating x is equal to sine of u, makukuha natin agad yung ating value ng u. Eh. So, paano? Si ating sign here, we can transpose dito para maiwan ng ating u. So, let's see kung magiging magdiderive tayo. Iwan natin si u dito and then si ating sign ay matatranspose. So, kapag positive, magiging negative. So, sign negative and then copy the x. So, we have the value of u. So, arc sine x. Now that we have the value of u, we can now substitute na dito. So, let's substitute. Our u is sine or arc sine x and then copy natin si C. And this is the integral of 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx. Ito. Diba? And that's it for today. Thank you.